If you want a website for your roofing services, then you have come here to the right place. Here I am gonna show you how to create this type of just roofing website without doing any single line of CSS code or HTML code. Without doing anything, you can just install full website with a single click. So I think this video is most helpful for you. So in this just take a look of this full website. You can see here everything is just editable and customizable. If I just click with edit the elementary web button, if I'm just showing you for an example. After element is reloading, just you can see if I'm just changing the text or text color or take me changing the text, just click on this text and just change the text like this heading. Now you can see just just like this when fraction of seconds you can change the in just text in front of you. So everything is editable and customizable. Here in this video, I'll just use only free themes and free plugins. So we have to purchase anything. Everything is just gonna fun. So without doing anything, let's get started the video. Welcome back to a brand new video. I'm Soma from Decreto Academy. All right. At first, just take a look of this hosting. So if you just plan to buy a hosting, so I would recommend to buy from the hosting from the Bluehost. If you just click on this WordPress, as I make you how to just create the WordPress website. So I'm just click on WordPress hosting. After clicking on WordPress hosting, you will see just scroll down and you will see this type of just packages section section. So you may have just confused, but uh, I am showing you just how to just what which plan for is for you for the best plan. So here you can see this is a basic plan, plus plan, choice plus plan, and then pro plan. You don't have to buy the pro plan. At least I am just showing you. Now you have to don't buy because it is just just amazing features it is just the top level notch level features you have to don't have to just don't need to this you can also just purchase it but i will suggest you to buy this the plan that is choice plus this is just unlimited website you can host then you can just get the unlimited ssd storage a normal in the normal just hostings companies that there has hdd storage like the, their hard disk storage that is too, too slow but ssd is in this 10x faster than hdd as you just know so that, that's why this is the unlimited ssd storage as you can see that and then this is just free domain for one year then they have provided you the ssl certificate then also free cdn everything so ssl if you just uh, questioning me what is free just ssl ssl means you can just if i'm just showing you from for and just uh, like an example just click on this lock icon you can see here just click on this then you can see this type of just just take that that is connection is secure if i'm just show you in my website that is academy.decrypto.in just click on this and you can see that this is the connection is secure that's like the is the, there is ssl installed so just you can just see in this plan you have to just ssl is already just free so you can also buy this plan you can just move over ssl is free but in this plan you get a lot of switches that is free automatic backup for one year then also everything is just you can just get without the, in this just single plan so i think just i will suggest you to regular this plan so just select this after selecting this then you have to fill up the form or sign up everything i'm just selecting any just domain name you have to choose or as your just uh, uh, website brand name or shop name everything you can just choose as your choice so i'm just i'm just taking for an example i'm just writing anything so if i'm just selecting those I'm just dot com so let me just show you you can see just click on this drop down menu you will see dot com dot wazi dot net online this is just extensions like facebook dot com youtube dot com flipkart dot com amazon dot com that's like this you have to just buy one extension for this so you can see this is a brand name like facebook youtube then dot com like this you have to buy an extension so you can choose as your choice i am just choosing dot com then just click on the, you can just choose free domain or you can just close this then if i just click on this edit just i will create my domain letter you can also skip this then just click on this next button you can also do this so as your choice then you can see this type of just in the website just text that is the domain is that this in this just text is available so you can just then fill up this form then just buy it so you can just see this is just cpp code card number everything you have to just payment from this so i don't have to buy this because i already already have so after this we will get a wordpress login and password so after this i'm just showing you so i'm just closing this all tabs then you can see this is just our website so i'm resetting all these things before resetting this 
please please like it, take a looks of this feature and take a just looks of this full features of this website if i'm just click on this get free estimate you can see this contact us page will open uh, with the seconds and this is the page this forms like you have to fill up then just have me send request you have will get a just a message and then you can see that about us section then if i'm just scrolling down then if i'm just told you can just see that everything is just irrelevant and customizable if i'm just showing you then you can also create it from the scratch but i'll show you how to just do without doing anything so just click on this logo and then go to the home page and setting all these things i'm just reading closing this tab so and then i'll just resetting all these things so i'm using wb reset to reset all these things so at first just go to the wb reset and type reset then just reset this site reset wordpress then is this resetting in for progress so it may take a few seconds then after process i am just showing you so if i am just log out so if you can see if you can log out so if you can see this table just you know, wordpress oh, you can get after the the hosting after getting the hosting you have to install the wordpress from the this softaculous then you can just um, just get this to just wordpress website so wordpress email, user email, email name or email address or email password so i'm just logging so after login you can just see this of just dashboard and that's just interface so just go to the skin options and just disable all these things high health status and act at a glance activity don't skip the activity and then just disable this is and just has high health status is just okay fine now so after this i'm just dragging drop it here and then just close this then you can see this of just interface clean and cool interface that's looking so better to understand so then go to the, at first just click on this appearance and go to the themes so go to the themes then you can see this time astra theme is here but you can you may not available for for your website just click on this add new then search for astra if i'm just showing you at first that is i am using only free themes here and free plugins so don't worry about this purchasing so just click on this install button here you can just show you the install button here i am already installed it so there that's why here is activating button is showing me that's why i'm just activating it so you can see that after few seconds it is activating so i'm just disabling this active i'm disabling the old theme as like it and just visit this site before installing the astra you can see here this is the site this is the site after don't uh, before installing the astra theme so after installing uh, activating and install installing activating the astra theme then if i'm just loading site you can see this is the changes so themes like that are phone launcher that is that you can after seeing the launcher for any, any launcher any apps if i'm just come if you are just instead interested about the phone launcher anything if we can just go to the play store or ios apps and then customize your as your choice by installing some any line type of launchers so that's like our themes if you just show just click on this mini install and everything so our just just website looks is just changeable and everything is just logo this type of menus will colors fonts will changeable then go to the plugins so like plugins like that or just phone applications or softwares like this so after installing you can just customize your phone as you need your phone as you choose that's like this type of just plugins after installing your plugins you can just choice as you change as your choice in the or wordpress website so here is only free plugins that is the popular plugins that is elementor it's that's it so this is the most popular and easy to use plugin you have to just install it and activate it after activating it so you can just go to the gopro version i am already keep the link in the description you can also go to the pro version but i'll show you in the elementor free version also you can just make it the full this type of just i've been showing you at the first website you can just make it from the free version you can just also go pro version you'll get lots of features so i'm just showing you the elementor free version then go to the add new plugins again then so if you search for elementor then you will see this is the essential you can just roll down this page you can see this is the essential add-ons for elementary you can also install this but this is the this is also a most important plugin you have to you can install it you will get caught and get lots of features about that then just go to the plus you can just crop icon and then if i'm searching for starter template if i'm just searching starter then you will see this is the astra strata will come this is strata template elementor gutenberg and river page will build the templates so this is the starter template so this is the just amazing plugin that to make your website without doing anything a single just click just click on activate 
so i'm already installed it in so i got just go to the install i install now and then activate it after that activating you will see this type of the starter template with c library also you can see this type of just app go to the appearance and then you can see this such template before doing anything let me just um, example um, just explain you about this plugin interface so don't install any other plugins which you have don't need so if i'm just showing you you can just click and clean this you can see here this is the elementor pro here i'm not using elementor pro so just don't don't just install it in the plugin section just i'm um, deleting it and then essential add-ons so in the essential add-ons we will get a just lot of feature but here is you know use an essential other plugins just click on ok reading it and then if you have to install two top this that is scroll root a button let me just show you and uh, go to the add new and then if i'm just switch, show you a two top then you will see then you can see this is the two top button just installing you two top that is scroll top if i'm just on the website you can just see this type of just in the bottom right section that is scroll to top just click on this and go to the just page smoothly just page the again the home page again so that is scroll to top just plugin just install it because we need this plugin and then w form slide you have to install this plugin it is also our needed plugin so just please install just only needed plugins don't install any other extra plugins that will just uh, just increase your website m the size that's it so and the, that will problem your on your website will, that the website will be loading very just slowly so that's why i'm just showing, just telling you then go to the appearance and go to the theme section also in the theme section also you have to just install only needed themes which i have been done just needed the other themes you have don't have to just install it anything or if you have installed in the pre pre, pre installed so just deleting it after how so how to delete it just click on this then you can see this was a delete button here so i'm just not deleting it because just i'm showing you in the demo section you can also delete it so after this plugins and themes installing session so next we have to move on the next step that is the page section just click on this page and all pages after selecting all pages you can see this was just only two pages here just click on this add new page after add new page you can also just use it any from here also you can just choose the page from here also you can just see appearance and then starter template you will after installing starter template you will see this type of sections and then you click on the starter template then you can see this type of interface just click on edit the elementor because i want to edit the elementor then if i search for just uh, if i'm searching this roof you can see here this is the roof servicing just is came just click on this and you can see this is the whole the website that is home about us service section project section contact us section everything so don't import the just separately you can see the project template or contact us template or anything service template about this template so don't import separately just click on the home and import complete site as i am show you you can all i mean in the i'm to i just told you in the first that is you can also import the full website with just in a single click that is the full just features of starter template and elementor that is the that is the full feature just powerful feature that is without just seeing without doing anything wordpress knowledge or anything you can just make a website as your choice that without a single click so if you just click on this import complete site then you will see just you can also just from the scratch you can also just from the scratch also you can just make it i'll show you just how to just create it and so i'm just going to import complete site then i'll just i'll show you later how to just create it from the scratch also just click on skip and after just seeing the few minutes or few seconds you can see the the full website will came in the our in the wordpress server so after this just let me just installing full things so you can just as i am just telling you you can just also just make the website from the scratch also in the just using essential addons and the elementor free pro version so you then you have to need the elementor pro that's why i'm just showing you in the starter template so you can see that the website is importing successfully just click on this visit site and closing this tab then just deleting it then you can see this type of just website or full of website template will came in the our websites wordpress so that is just amazing plugin that is starter template then you can see there is any snow animation or smoothness everything you can see that after installing two top the just this of your scroll button also all this already came in the website so let me just copying let me just let me just copy this i am using html color picker so you can also use it html color picker that is just amazing so to pick, take the color just copy this and go to the top two top set you must load this page again and you can see this is the two top setting is here so just click on this 
then don't just need to anything just click on this again and select the color so I'm just pasting the color as you just you can also choose as your brand color so I'm just keeping the borders to 50% then just save changes after saving changes just click on this reload button so we will see this to just interface just apply that was icon colors just click on this and smoothly come over to the section so here you can see this is the big padding so how to just do this at first i am just showing you how to do this type of just home page just customization and how to do just make it from the scratch and how to do this type of just icons and this type of just interface and this is the countdown section then i'll show you how to just edit the footer how to sorry how to edit the header and this type of just if you just click on this button there is nothing this is the only has has link is here so how to connect with the contactor section and how to connect with the, this type of just forms and how to make this then i'll show you how to just create it from the footer so at first just go to the home section so click on the edit with elementor button this is just cool button so if you if you just click on this edit elementor then you will see this type of just elementor dashboard is just loading after loading i don't want to give the this type of just huge padding just click on the three dot sections go to the advanced tab and then you can see this type of top so top will be i am just giving it to 200 then you can see this test are looking cool then go to the update after updating if i'm just click on this any button there you can see this is the only hash link is here so i'm just i don't want to create that i'm just want to connect with the contact us page so how to create that at first just click on this contact us page then you can see this page id came here is not contact us page came so if you just click on this dashboard and then go to the settings go to the general then you have to must do it before doing anything just go to the you can just tagline so you have to change the tagline that is everything is just welcome to my everything roofing if i'm just rise just if i'm just showing you in the sum just example welcome to my roofing services just then just save changes after clicking this then just click on this uh, right reading section then you can see this is the static page that is the home page and you have to select only home page then just click on this save changes after saving this then click on the permalinks you have to must do it that is post name you have to must do it that is post name then just click on save changes after doing just post name then you will see after just click on the, if I'm just loading this page then if i'm just going just click on this contact section so you can see that the contact us this text will is just showing in the links url section so that is the just permalink you have to must do it so just closing this so you have to must do it and then just i'm copying the url to connect in the button just click on this button then you can see this link so i'm just pasting it the link and then this is the link service link so if you just go to the home page and then go to the service page then i'm just copying the service url service page url then just paste it here then just update it after updating just i'm go to the home page then you can see this is the pair huge padding padding will gone and then if you just click on this and then it will just redirect to the contact us page then if you just click on this services then service page will came so that's it and then if i'm just show you this is the form so how to edit the form if you just click on this form then you can see this w form so let me just show you how to create the w forms just click and after installing w forms you will see this two just w forms here just click on this all forms after clicking on all forms i'm just let me just create a new tab here so let me just create a new tab then you can see this type of contact form is already made it so i don't want to just use it so let me just the, the new one let me just create a new one just click on add new after clicking on add new then you will see this type of just interface so just click on anything if i'm just showing you the contact form a contact form new if i'm just writing contact form new just click on blank form also you can just also use the template that is use template i'm just if i'm just showing you view team demo that is like this type of just interface you will see name email and message so i don't know to just use the template i mentioned let me just show you from the scratch that is how to made it you can see the see after click on black for you will see this type of the interface so that is so simple and easy to make that is like elementor we have to drag and drop the just anything any field so if you add one add just a name just drag and drop it here as you can see this is the heritage game just click on this you can also choose as your choice that is first middle last then you can also choose from simple then i'm just showing you in the simple then just i'm going here just giving the height that required and then you go to the advanced tab and hide the label so i don't have to recreate that and then placeholder name if i'm just writing a name then you can see the name is game 
then the go to the add fields if i'm just adding number just drag and drop it here and then click on this and if i'm just writing type everything if i'm just writing type your phone number anything and then go to the advanced tab and hide the label and if just placeholder text go to the placeholder text and just label just text um, sorry i'm just click on click on this again and then go to the advanced tab and placeholder text like this you can also add this so after adding you can just also add the email section just click on this and you can also immediate the paragraph section you can just come just click on this and if i'm just writing like like uh, type uh, type comment everything you can also do it type comment everything so let me just create the save and then after saving you will see so just cl close the tab and just load this page you will see the w forms so yeah, as you can just after the element is just loading so after this you can see this is the forms just click on this forms and then you can see this is the w form is also came then just you can see this is the contact form if you just click on this drop down menu then you can see contact form new so just click on this as i am just showing you this is the page this form is came you can see the name type phone number email and type comment so i am as it is from the dash do it so i don't want to just create the uh, as my com just com this is the forms so you can see this is the um, just old form is already came this is the, the default form then you can just change the text everything by clicking on this you can just change it from here also you can just click on this then you can just also change the text from here just click on this if i'm just go to the style tab then i can change the color from here you can see that the guy can change the color from here then go to the typography and i'm giving it to poppins font and font weight will be like this i'm just typing poppins font and then the font weight will be like 700 like this and then just update it after updating i'm just copy this and paste it here after pasting it so sorry i'm just pasting whole so i'm just paste the style and then go to the style tab and give it the color to black pure black here you can see this is the black scheme so i don't don't just create this only this is a paste style then just click on this and go to the style tab and giving the color to like uh, pure black color so you can see this tab and then i'm just go to the content and give it to center then the what is the heading everything is just everything is now fine so here is this and then go to the, go to the style and go to the typography and giving it to poppins font you can also choose from the first so i'm just click on poppins then you can see this type interface then you click on just get free estimate then you can also choose the contact us page link here is it or just click on just copy this and you can also just paste it here you can also paste it here then just update it after updating you will see this type just inter just load this page then scroll down if you just click on the get free estimate you will see in the contact us page again so that is the just features so if you just load this page you can see this interface just click on this it will contact us page will came so i don't know to just recreate it so you can see that this is there is nothing just motion effects or everything so we just want to add motion effects and and then i'll show you how to edit the header footer or how to make it responsive so at first just go to the just section you can see just click on this you can also change the headings or everything from here and then just click on this you can see this is the icon box if i'm just showing you just click on the display icon if i'm just searching for icon box just place it here after placing it just i'm duplicating it again so i'm just sorry i'm just deleting it and then if i'm just searching for icon box and just place it then click on this and go to the style tab and this is the content and everything you can just also change it by click on here tab advanced tab and background then you can just background color then you can choose the background color from here also then go to the, go to the advanced tab and give the padding from here if i'm just writing 50 pixel padding so you can see this the bit padding is here so after giving the icon just click on this go to the, sorry i'm just go to the content and go to the icon library now you can just writing anything if i'm just writing arrow so you can see that this is the arrow up is just insert here you can see the arrow is came if you want to add like this so just go to this and you can see the icon position left just click on this you can also add icon position left and go to the tab you will see this is the top is came then go to the style tab and go to the content and you can also choose the center left right justify everything you can also just create it so i don't want to recreate it i'm just deleting it let me just i'm showing you the process how to just make it 
so after this i am just showing you um, how to just edit the and customize the home page or everything so you can see that this is the just um, this this is the full just everything just everything you can see that estimate and this is the um, just every i what's an achievement you can just click on it and you can just change the everything so i'm just adding the motion effects that is most most important thing just click on this and then just go to the advanced tab then go to the motion effects then just uh, you can see this enter animation just click on this fading left you can see this just fading left is came and just click on this so i'm just click on this column and then go to the advanced tab and motion effects and fading left giving the fading left so it will the full section is come from fading left and then the forms just click on these forms and then go to the advanced tab and go to the motion effects and this is the fading just right it will come from left and then in this tab just interface just click on this column advanced tab motion effects and go to the fading left and it will also come from fading left right so motion effect just makes your website looks more cool just click on this and go to the advanced tab and this is the more fading uh, up will came and also this tab just and go to the fade and motion effects and fade in up will came then i'm just if i'm just adding you just click on this and go to the advanced tab and again let me just i'm just showing you the process how to add it so i i can add it as your choice so if i'm just adding one more that is like this motion effects and fade in sorry fade in left and you can just add your choice i'm just not adding it anymore so i'm just updating the page after updating page if i'm just loading this page again then you can see this type of just interface scheme this would be smooth come of our effect and this type of just form effect you can just see here this type of just effect and the image is just hovering you can see here the response are effects so now i'm showing you how to edit the footer header and the footer you can see here this is the footer so as i already showed that this is the full website is already came without single line of coding or anything just click on this projects contact us you can choose anything and i am already show you how to just change the forms or how to create or forms anything and how to customize how to come change the content and everything i'll show you at first so now you can if you just questioning me how to change the image background images just click on this section go to the style tab here you can see this just background images here so you can also change it by clicking on this choose image then just go to the media library you will see lots of images that is already have so you can just also change it from here you can also just click on this choose image and go to the upload files and select the files here drop the files as your choice just and it as your requirement just click on this insert media then insert it so that's the process of changing problem image the changing image so and now i'm creating the changing the header just click on this customize go to the customize then this is reload and just loading so after this you will see this type of just interface so click on this logo then you will see this type of just logo here this you can just change the logo just click on this you can also change the logo from here so you can change after you as you need so this is the just logo and then this is the menu just click on this let me just create a new menu where from you can create a menu let me just create a new menu that is appearance and then menus just menu go to the menu then you can also see that this is the menu is already that's contact info that is can and this is our service that is also so i'm just selecting this then you can see this our service this is also just already made and this is the primary menu that i'm selecting it then you can see this is the primary menu is already came if i'm just adding one more setting that is just blogs just click on this content custom links and if i'm just go to the hash link if i'm writing blog then just click on this add menu also you can also enter just click and you can see this also drag and drop it like this you can also make it sub by team then you can also just make it the blog like this and just save menu after saving after saving you will just reload this page after from just loading this page you can see so let me just load let me just load this page you can see that this is the blog is came so this is the blog you can just also if i'm just click on this anything so i'm just loading this page again so if i'm just click on this blog you can see this is nothing because um, i'm not not just creating the blog page you can also add it and let me i'm just processing how to add the text in the menu that's why i'm just showing you in the hash link so 
and this you can see this is just all everything so this is the header so just click on this same settings and just click on this and then you can see the logo and this is the just primary menu and everything you can also change the color from the and just click on this design and then you can also change the menu color you can also change the just background color you can also change the menu font if i'm just showing you if i'm just click on this and if i'm just writing poppins font then you can see the pop-in fonts is also came just click on this button you can also change the button here just click link so if i'm just writing contact us page link so i'm just writing it so just creating it and if i'm just writing contact us page link and paste it here then just publish it after publishing so i'm just loading this page again so just click on this great festival then you'll see contact us page is already came just go to the home page again then just click on great festival button just the contact us will came so that's why just how you redirect this page then you can also change the just image and you go to the design tab and you can also change the colors and you can also change the menu color background color everything you can also change the buttons everything you can also change the at side logo everything so now i'm just showing you how to just edit the footer again go to the customize you can also go to the customize and for from the first and you can also change the footer so i'm just scrolling down scrolling down scrolling down after this you can see this is the footer is came just click on this you will see this type of just footer this is prime primary footer this is the primary footer is came so you can also change it by clicking on here also just click on this go to the style settings and if you can also change the settings from here go to the social you can see the social is came so you can also change the social area icon from the game and you can also change the copyright text also you can just change it right from here so just click on this widget you can see the widget is loading so after doing this you can also change the from from here widget 3 this is the widget 3 means this is the widget 3 just click on this you can see this is the home ever session also you can just removing this anything you can also change the link from here also you can just click on this and you can also change the custom link from here so just click on this and then you can also change the custom roofing everything just click on pub publish you can see this is the com commercial scheme so that's you can just change it from here this is the footers icon so if i'm just closing this tab then just loading this page again so now here you can see this is the just all features scheme full features scheme then if i'm just showing you um, how to just make it responsive just click with edit it elementor then in the element term you have to, to make it responsive it's so easy to just use just click on this responsive mode you can see this is the responsive mode is here you can also change it then you can just click on this mobile icon then just click on this tab view so you can just see that this is the tab view this is how your website is looks like in the tab view just scroll down you can see this it is the premier template that's why you don't have to customize anymore that's the premium the features of the but you will get free for free you can just see everything you will get for free then just click on this mobile view so you will see the mobile view how it looks like then you can see this the mobile view looks like this just click on this you can also give the center and also click on this give the center and click on this text and go to the style tab and give the center alignment so you can also change the azure boy choice azure requirement you can also change it so you can see this the just all features is just working properly so this is the just more countdown section and everything so now i'm just let me show you how to just create the countdown section if i'm just if you questioning me how to create it just click on this and you can see this is the counter just click on the risk square icon if i'm just searching for counter so if I'm just, let me just search for it counter you can see the counter is just came just place it here after placing it you can see this is the same feature just like this you can also change it just click on this and you can also change the text from here if i'm just writing commercial you can see that this is came just simply you have to don't have to customize anymore just deleting it so you can just make it from the counter section i'm just already show you you can also just make it from the scratch also even or you can also make it from the handmade that pre-made that is starter template so this is the full website i'm showing you from the scratch that is how to install themes plugins and how to customize header footer and how to make it responsive how to change the content text everything and how to link to the, to the buttons to the redirect button you just click on this and get the contact us page will automatically came this is the page and if you like this video 
so please share with your friends who need it and we give it a big thumbs up and comment down below how is it and if you practice with me so please comment down that you practice with me and if you want more topic as your choice so please comment down as your topic topic and if you want more page builder like dv page builder w bakery weaver oxygen everything you can just comment down so i'll cover your topic later so see you in the next video with a new topic till then bye bye thank you so much for watching